Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. My name's Jason and I'm your watch guy today. You will have seen me review Zalosas on the channel before. I've reviewed two up to now, but they've never been mine. I've always been loaned them by a subscriber, a subscriber called Jason who is very, uh, very generous. But I managed to pick up one of the latest releases from Zalos. I managed to pick up a 40mm swordfish and it's the best colorway that they had. It's definitely the best dial option. I don't know why anyone picked anything else, unless these ones sold out super quick, which they did, they did. I think these all sold out in about nine minutes or something like that. I think this particular dial model was gone in three. So yeah, I was really excited to get hold of one. So today I'm going to be unboxing my first Zalos. Well, un unboxing my first Zalos. I've, I've already unboxed the Zalos before. I get my first one to keep, I guess. So let's turn this camera around and let's get into the video. So this, this should definitely be the Zelos. Uh, I don't think anything else has come through FedEx. It should have been here yesterday, actually. So that was a massive letdown for me. Dead upset about that. I think these took about a month to ship out. So that's something to be aware of when you, if you're buying one of these or if you're lucky enough to get on one of their drops. They usually don't ship instantly. It will be about a month wait, or somewhere around that type of time. Usually Alsham will inform you of it beforehand, but it's definitely worth the wait if any of the last ones I've reviewed are anything to go by. They've also changed the packaging on these ones, which will be nice to see. I believe it's still the same box, but no, no, it's a different box too. Made an absolute liar of me. Let's flip this over. So it's a more elongated, flatter box which I think relates to the packaging that they're using inside now. Nice cardboard, outer shell, a wooden box. The unboxing experience with Zalos is very premium, considering I paid less than £200 for this watch. An absolutely incredible price, especially considering what we're about to unbox. It's, it's a fantastically amazing looking watch. I've seen a lot of other people on the uh, Zalos group, posting pictures of theirs, making me dead jealous. So they used to come in a watch roll, but Elshan has uh, updated the packaging to this little leather, or at least leather feeling pouch. Obviously we still get the wooden box. I think that's a brilliant little like thing to, to send the watch in, you know, it, it feels really premium. Feels, yeah, like, like a premium watch and box and like a premium feeling brand and this feels really good too actually i believe this is what they will all be supplied in from the future this will be the first drop that's actually supplied in them though let's see what we've got look at that beautiful little thing there all right i'm going to put the watch to one side i'm going to get slated in the uh, comments because you're not here to see the, the packaging you're here to see the watch etc etc but let's just go through this and see what we've got some silica pouches that you definitely, definitely shouldn't eat. And we have our guarantee card. Nothing else in here, nothing else in here. Didn't expect anything else, to be honest. The guarantee cards from Zalos is a metal card. Very nice. So mine is number 156. And there we can see there the date. And signed by Zalos. Who else is it going to be signed by, I guess? Really nice. Just all the little features are taken care of. Now, they really knock the watches out of the park too, so that's always a bonus. But it's nice to have these little extras while you're unboxing a watch. And this is something they can use in the future, so that's also a very nice feature. I mean, everyone's got like a million watch boxes in the closet, so <laughs> it's nice to have something that you can use in the future. So this is the Zelos 40mm Swordfish. Absolutely gorgeous dial on it. Have a look at that. The grain type of effect on that burgundy dial. That's why I picked this one up, because I thought out of all of them, this dial does the most on the new releases. Let's start peeling off the stickers. I was very eager to get a Zelos this year. Uh, before this year came in, I did make my own little promise to myself that I was going to buy certain 
brands I was going to pick up certain watches when they were released because I missed out on a lot last year. This was the first, this is actually the first new watch that I bought this year. Or first new watch that isn't from AliExpress, that is. I don't know why, but I don't really ever count the AliExpress watches that I get. Okay, that's interesting. We also have the quick release bars that I saw on the uh, the black tip that Jason loaned the channel. I like the lang the angular surround of the um, the sapphire on this one. That bezel is absolutely solid. Surely, this has got to be the best watch you can pick up for two hundred pounds. Look at that dial. The loom is going to be an insane on it, but I'll leave that for the actual review. What have we got here? The bracelet feels really nice. It doesn't feel as nice as the black tip, but obviously there is a price disparity there. So that is something that you would expect. Now, of course, I'm going to have to size this up and get it on wrist before I end this video. I am very, very pleased with this. I think a lot of people are going to be a little bit jealous of this one. This is one of those watches that you look back on after they've been released and you start to see the pictures and you regret not getting onto it before they sold out. And as I say, they sold out really, really quickly. The website actually stopped loading on my laptop. I had to uh, jump onto my phone to order this one and got really, really panicked. But it all worked out in the end. Also, Colour match date wheel is always a nice feature. It's in the perfect six o'clock position. As you know, I do enjoy the date window at six o'clock. It just makes the whole dial more aesthetically pleasing. It just looks better on the eye. It makes everything line up nicely. It is also a sandwich dial, which is nice to see. I do enjoy a sandwich dial also. This, this watch just does so much for the price. As I say, I paid less than £200 for this. I believe they were out for £259, something like that. After the exchange rate, it worked out at 194 I think. Then my bank stole about £2 for a foreign transaction, but yeah, they can have that. I don't mind. Sign crap, yeah. I'm going to have to size this up quickly before I just go straight into a review of it because it, yeah, it's absolutely fantastic. It looks absolutely amazing. So here is the Zelos Swordfish 40 on wrist and it feels really, really comfortable on wrist actually. Uh, they have really small links on the bracelet, which makes it very conformative to wrist. Aid someone with wrist sizes like myself. Look to looks quite short. Yeah, I'm, I'm very happy with this one. Very, very happy with this one. And it was only, well, it was less than £200. So if you could believe that, it is an NH35 movement, so that will keep the costs down. But just the absolute brilliant build quality in this, it's, yeah, I am very, very impressed by Zalos. As I always am, Elshan does an amazing job on these watches. I believe the bronze edition of this has already gone on sale and sold out also. And I think the Hammerhead is next. Maybe a bit big for me. I'm very happy with my swordfish, as I am sure everyone else who bought one is. So guys, that is my unboxing of the 40mm swordfish from Zalos. As I say, this is my first Zalos. This is the first Zalos that I've been able to actually purchase for myself. And what a watch to pick up. For less than £200, it's just a bargain. Absolute bargain. So if Zalos and Elshan decide to release any more of these swordfish 40 mils, I really do recommend that you get on it as quickly as you possibly can because they run out very fast, very fast indeed. I have linked Zalos's website in the description. However, I'm pretty sure that there's not really available at the minute. There may be some of the higher end models there to pick up. Uh, but yeah, that, that's where you'll go if you want to buy one. They also have a Facebook group called Zalos Timekeepers. That is really, really informative if you want to try and get on to the next drop. Elshan posts a lot in there. Please remember to subscribe to the channel, guys, and I will see you in the next one.